what's going on guys, Onside Baller TV, the ultimate destination for all things football, whether you're a die-hard fan, or you just love the beautiful game, you've come to the right place. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join our passionate football community, because here at Onside Baller TV, football isn't just a sport it's a way of life. Champions League resumed today. I want to recap the game and highlights all the goals between Manchester City vs FC Copenhagen, what a game. If you miss the game don't worry, I got you with all the recap and so much more about the boys in blue. Guys, do me a favor on hit the subscriber button, like and share his video, don't forget to hit the bell, so when I post you don't miss any of this news, on so much more, Manchester City resumed their Champions League defense with a comfortable 3-1 win at FC Copenhagen on Tuesday. Kevin De Bruyne and Bernardo Silva netted either side of an unexpected Magnus Matson equalizer as City dominated a last-16 first leg they could have won far more convincingly. Pep Guardiola's side dominated in every aspect at the Danish capital's famously atmospheric Parken Stadium and Phil Foden completed a deserved success late on, with close to 80% possession. The holders were hardly troubled and will be confident of wrapping up a place in the quarterfinals when the sides meet. Again in Manchester, in three weeks the only real downside for City was the loss of Jack Grealish through injury in the first half, despite having almost complete control, one thing City could not do was silence the home fans. As anticipated, Copenhagen's raucous following produced an intimidating atmosphere and greeted every City attack with loud whistles and even a siren, yet it appeared to have no effect on City, who immediately imposed themselves and should have taken the lead when De Bruyne fluffed a header from a Nathan Ake cross. Ruben Dias also forced a save from Kamil Grabera and Ake fired the rebound over, although a raised flag suggested neither might have counted. Copenhagen, their rustiness amid Denmark's long winter break evident, were struggling to live with City, and it came as no surprise when De Bruyne hit his 11th-minute opener. The Belgian, who has quickly eased back into gear after a long injury layoff, timed his run onto a Foden pass superbly and finished clinically with a low shot. City looked hungry for more and Erling Holland was inches away from meeting a De Bruyne cross before a Silva ball was deflected onto the woodwork by Dennis Bavro. City suffered a blow when Grealish, making his first start in six games, was forced off after 21 minutes soon after a challenge from Diogo Goncalves but his replacement, Jeremy. Doku added more energy to City's attack. Within moments of coming on Doku set up Holland for what would have been a spectacular goal with a volleyed cross, but the Norwegian's overhead kick flew over. City looked capable of running up a huge score, but remarkably found themselves level when Ederson gifted the hosts an equalizer on 34 minutes. The goalkeeper passed straight to Mohamed El Yunusi and, although the former Southampton forward shot was blocked, Debutant Matson followed up with a fine finish. Matson, a recent signing from NEC Nijmegen, almost added another soon after but blazed over. The home fans were animated, but their excitement was not to last. Silva restored normal order before the break with a fine flicked finish after De Bruyne got the better of Matson to pick out the Portuguese. De Bruyne almost added to the lead early in the second half when he tested Grabera before Holland headed tamely at the keeper and Foden had an effort deflected wide. Grabera also pushed away a long-range Doku strike and Holland was twice denied by the keeper in stoppage time before Foden wrapped up the win after exchanging passes with De Bruyne. Guys, what a game. Now I want to hear from you all tell me what you think about the game. What do you think about Ederson give away the goal, do you think City will make it back to the final? Guys, leave your comments below, if you enjoyed this video. Hit that subscribe button on don't forget to ring the notification bell. Catch you in the next one, Onside Baller TV. Bye for now.